RV base camp. There's the forerunner. Let's go on an adventure. Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to today's vlog. Gonna try something a little different today and do a little adventure. So uh, come along with me. See what we can get into. All right, folks. Just probably a mile, maybe a mile down the road from RV base camp. We're here at Quarter Creek Recreation Area. And there's a concrete picnic table right back there, just one by itself, right by the road. It's kind of like a, well, you know, you're here, you're, you know, you can picnic there as well. It has warmed up today, that's for sure. We are definitely, uh, Skipping right past spring, right into summer heat, which I'm fine with it. I'd a lot rather have that than cold. So here we are back at the same place we were at a few days ago. We'll see if anybody's here today. And it looks like no, no one. Yay. Well, not really. It wouldn't be awful if, I better not say that. There's a little bit of shade right over here. I think I'm gonna take advantage of. Get out and see how it looks. Let's see if I can get possession here if I'm too far back. There's the pavilion. Yeah, I think I'm going to pull forward a little bit more. Stay on the gravel. And we're here. So let's check it out. Absolutely beautiful, folks. No one here. Got a really nice fishing pier. That's the Quarter Creek Bridge right up there. And there's my baby. Look how good it looks, man. I'm telling you, that is an awesome looking vehicle. I love it. All right, let's get started having some fun. It's actually fairly clean uh, in the pavilion. I'm 
quite surprised, really. Uh, thank goodness people are trying to keep it fairly clean. So I got my toolboxes with me. And you probably know what that means. RC cars. Let's do some adventuring. Get these bad boys out and have some fun. I'm so out of shape, it's pitiful. <laughs> Here we have the truck, newly repaired. so I don't get a bunch of trash in. And get ready to have some fun. Get ready to have some fun. All right. No one here at all. Someone spilt something on the table there and didn't clean it up. All right, just a quick tour of the pavilion area and so you can kind of see it. It's a really nice shelter, really nice area. As you can see the sign. Pause that. It does have a nice kind of grill area right here, you know, uh, Eight nice benches, picnic tables, nice concrete floor, fairly clean, a little bit of small trash around, but they keep it mowed. Uh, they mow this area right here, and there's a little walking trail right here. Uh, I'm not sure how far it goes or what all is involved there, but uh, I do know uh, you need to watch where you step for various reasons but you know the shelter is really nice uh it's a pretty area and really grateful to have it so close by all right folks time to start with the first one brought the spare motor and stuff in case i decide to swap that out this hasn't been charged since the other day when I when I 
charged it up and replaced the motor. That's been probably four or five days ago at least. So we'll see how that pans out. I do have the charger with me. I don't know if there's a plug in here or not. I need to look for one. I don't believe there is. Nope. No electricity here, Bubba. Sorry. All right. Got spider webs on my face. All right, I think I'm locked down, pinned down, ready to roll. All right, let's see what happens. down here I can't believe it's actually working again yay Makes a lot of noise, but All right, I'll move the camera over here so I can rip it a little bit. It's looking really good. Screams, man. Wow. I believe that motor made it faster.
<laughs> Damn, this sucker's badass, man. I can't believe how good it's been. Wow, on a 2S battery. Can you imagine this thing on a stronger battery? Holy mackerel. Battery's done, that's what it is. <laughs> Run that battery down, I bet you. That's what it is, I think. The batteries run down. Because it's turning everything. It just don't have enough power to pull it. It's hot as fire, that's for sure. Yeah, that's what it is. It's got to be. And then I got the crawler. So that just tells me I need to make sure they're charged up. These things have got to be maintained just like anything else. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Boy, I know one thing, man. It'll fly now. Amazing. I believe it's faster than it was. Here comes a boat by. Just a little one. 
Little fishing boat. He roaring right on by, boy. How's it going? He probably don't want to be filmed. He going to stop. All right, folks. I've made it back. And I'm going to get the RC cars out of the forerunner. Up right here, let's see how that looks. All right. Wash the forerunner bad. Here's our seat car number one. Boy, the bumblebees and stuff are all going crazy. They're glad it's summertime, too, I think. Yeah, I'm going to get the tools out and the charger back out. This needs to go over here for now first. RC tools. I like having this toolbox instead of all the other ones, smaller ones. I think I enjoyed that very much, no doubt. No doubt. All right, let's get the charger out. Might as well take this on inside. This is my battery charger. Sure is nice being able to walk underneath the canopy again. So I think I'm going to get my batteries out of here and put the 
put them inside until I get ready to, to go again and charge them before I go. Put these clips back on. That's just to go ahead and put them back on, I guess, because that way they don't get lost. There's that one. <coughs> I want to get the batteries out of here. bag has got batteries in it now I want to go ahead and put them back up these back in the ah If one will fit up there or not, I doubt one more will fit. I'm going to try it though.
Nope. That works. All right, I'm going to put this stuff in a tub. That it can live in. I think this is the only one, really. I need these inside. Just gonna take them in. And that can live right there. All right. There's that. A little bit of a breeze blowing. I'm going to get the itch to go camping bad.
here and then two and two. All right, folks, sun's about to go down, and neighbor's dog is barking, and ATV is running great. Uh, I've got no problems with it. I've got it parked not here, but over here, because I'm planning on spraying some of the mud off of it after it cools down a little bit. It's pretty filthy and I thought I'd just try to rinse a coat of the dirt off of it. But anyway, as you can see, it's, the sun's going down. I just got back from a ride. Everything went fine on the ride. Um, really happy with with the way it's uh, it's running for sure. So uh, just wanted to cut back in and uh, catch you up on what's going on. I sprayed a layer of the yellow off the. Forerunner. I need to put these inside the pop up. And then bring these batteries inside. And as you can see, my night lights are working. Got one over here, too. I need to grab my glasses while I'm out here. Hey. All right. Glasses on. All right. It's about time to fix something for supper. So here we go.